Go dummy, go beast on him. I go beast. Go deep, I OD on him. Apply pressure, put heat on him. Put that five zero zero degrees on him. Five hundred degrees. Go dummy, go beast on him. I go beast. Go deep, I OD on him. Apply pressure, put heat on him. Put that five zero zero degrees on him. Five hundred degrees. Go down, let it play. On the scene, franchise best on the team. Blue faces busting on the scene. New life is something like a dream. Back out fresh on the scene. YouTubers Dre here, Recovery One Drones. This will get my latest little tidbits about flying. Like I say, I'm trying to uh, give you some of my experiences uh, out while I'm out doing work, so you can be aware of some of the things, same things that you may encounter. Uh, today I'm in the uh, north end of. Fontana, California off of the uh, 15 freeway. It's a 133 acre housing track being developed. I've shot some video of this before, but today uh, was a little interesting today. Uh, in the past, I had heard some of the high pitched sounds of uh, either drones or RC aircraft. And today confirmed what I had heard before. And it kind of goes with being situational awareness and also it goes in, it going going about being considerate and also talking to your fellow plot pilots that you share airspace with. We talk about sharing airspace with manned aircraft, but you also may be in a situation where you need to share airspace with other UAS devices in the area. Uh, today, when I got off the freeway to the site, I uh, stopped and talked to about three gentlemen that were flying RC uh, fixed wing aircraft and just inquired about what altitude they were flying at. I let them know who I was, what I was going to be doing, and the altitude I was going to be flying. Uh, they have been flying there for years. Uh, they were a little disappointed about the development because now they're not going to be able to fly their fixed wing aircraft in this area probably by the end of next year when these houses start taking shape. As I was flying, uh, I said getting set up to fly, I noticed a uh, quad Copter drone uh, sneak right up on me, and uh, I quickly looked up, saw what it was. It was a DJI Air 2S, and I'm thinking maybe one of the guys that I just talked to has one and decided to fly up and take a look at me. And I said, "Well, no, it, it didn't go back that direction. I actually went further north up the uh, roadway, so I saw a vehicle that was parked on the shoulder, like I am, and uh, I said, "Oh, the guy's out there flying his uh, DJI uh, drone." So I got my business card out, and I, as I, just at the same time I was launching my aircraft, so I walked down to where he's at, about maybe a quarter of a mile away, and I just introduced myself and uh, I let him know, hey, I'm here for this purpose. Same thing I told the other guys, I'll be flying at 400 feet, AGL, mapping this site. And uh, he said, oh, no problem, I you know, appreciate it, gave him my card, no problems at all, you know. So I say, when you're out and about, uh, usually I fly alone. So I don't go out in groups. Uh, I think I've only been out with another flyer one other time uh, since I've been flying. So it's not uh, usual for me to encounter other uh, drone operators, or RC operators. So I took it upon myself to take the initiative to introduce myself, let them know what my purpose is. So I didn't want to have any type of incidents of drones colliding or my, like I told the guy with the DJI drone, uh, let's make sure we stay out of each other's uh, airspace as far as uh, feet wise so we don't get any cross interference. Uh, I know people have talked about where they have gotten cross interference from another drone especially if it's a DJI drone if you don't fix your your frequency it does jump around that you can go through your menu and see that and uh, sometimes uh, you guys can cross uh, connect to where you lose control of your drone or he can may lose control of his either one. So these are things you need to be mindful of uh, and so forth. So when you find yourself flying around other people, uh, you also want to announce what uh, AGL you're flying in, but also might have to go down to the point where you're flying DJI aircraft or maybe even Autel aircraft, let them know what frequency that you're flying on. It may be the same thing for RCs. I'm not in depth in RCs, but I'm sure there are others that, that are and can tell let you know this is the frequency that I'm flying on. So let's make sure we don't cross each other's paths and lose connection to our, our UASs. So this is Dre. 
with this little construction tip, commercial flying tip, whatever you want to call it, uh, DGA tip. So I always say, hey, be safe out there. Hang on, enjoy the ride, and please subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Look, okay, I'm back out fresh on the scene. Franchise best on the team. Blue faces busting out the scene. New life is something like a dream. Back out fresh on the scene. Franchise best on the team. Blue faces busting out the scene. New life is something like a dream. New life is something like a dream. New life is something like a blue face and bust another. New life is something like a dream. New life is something like a dream. I am not friendly, I came for the paper, little baby, don't get it confused. I see them paying the play, they be paying for my I'm paying my dues. They cannot see me unless I'm on TV in times when they happen to turn on the news. I am not worried about with the money, cause you cannot buy with all of them views. I've been on 10 like fourth grade. Same, but I'm more paid. Lame, throwing more shade. But you know it don't phase me. I'm blowing out gas to the hole with hazy. With a new chick, cause my old crazy. Just a young player that the West Side made me. But how could you. Thank you.